Hi, I'm Barbara Alexander, and I want to share a little bit about our program in France and what we were learning about leadership. Eight of us women took off for Provence, where we had an absolutely magical time. We had a beautiful chateau that we stayed in for the entire week. It had everything we could possibly want, including the most glorious pool. We were surrounded by beautiful lavender fields. After we got a first night's rest, we spent the day getting acclimated to being in France. And where better to do that than at the market at Sur la Sorgue? We got to taste the food, see the clothes, feel the experience of all the people and the food. Oh my goodness, buy fresh fruits and vegetables and see the beautiful architecture. It was breathtaking. I think everybody had an opportunity to bring something home. I had no idea there were over 50 kinds of olives, everything from mild to very hot. <laughs> and we enjoyed it all. That night, we had a very special event. It was our first experience of a key. Megalie Delgado and Frederic Pignon put together the most spectacular show. It was one of the highlights of our trip. It was all about their love for the land, for the animals, for the humans that take care of this precious earth we live on. It was touching beyond words. And the exquisite joy that all of the professionals that were involved in the show, all of the horses, the joy was so clear and it permeated the entire audience. It was amazing how much you could feel between the humans and the animals and how much love and joy they experienced through this work they're doing together. And after the show, we got to go backstage as VIPs later that night. Here's where we met some of the most incredible performers. Such beautiful hearts, sweet beings, amazing stallions. Enjoying a little scratch. <laughs> Our days were a mixture of learning in the mornings, touring on some days and enjoying the provincial countryside, and the evenings we spent with the horses. It was delightful to be able to just luxuriate in the pool and spend some time in the quiet. That afternoon, we went over to the horses and spent time getting to know the stallions at the Delgado breeding farm, home to many of the horses that were in the show. We had the opportunity to work with our own energy to learn about leadership and energy modulation and to practice the skills of working with another in co-creation. We had to find that balance to stay aligned and to stay focused in the direction we're wanting to go helping those we're working with also stay focused in that direction. It was about personal balance, about building relationship, and about clarity of direction. It was wonderful to watch each of the women go in and have an experience with the horses. Some were horsewomen and some were not. But we all learned about our energy, how to use it, how to modulate it. We learned about assertiveness and levels of energy. And then each of us playing and learning how to master each of those levels, even though they didn't always come naturally. <laughs> the horses were just amazing teachers for each of us. They responded in the moment to every move we made, they could tell if we were clear in our intention or if we were wavering. And when we wavered, they didn't respond. The next morning we went to Gord. And of course we had market day once again. Oh, what a beautiful medieval town this is. 
it's really hard to capture the incredible history and feel and beauty of this place. We all tried. <laughs> yes, I'm taking a video. <laughs> wow, <laughs> how much fun we had exploring, shopping, and enjoying this incredible countryside. And that afternoon, it was back to the horses an opportunity to discuss what we've learned, take it to the next level, and then discuss again what each person experienced once they were in there. It was amazing. Each woman brought their own unique energy to that arena, and each horse brought its own we had an opportunity to experience what it takes, sometimes a little energy and sometimes a lot, depending on who you're working with. But we all found that place of connection, that place of working together and co-creation. This was so much more than leadership skills development and energy modulation. What we found on a deeper level is how we choose to present ourselves and be in our life. It's leadership of our life. There seems to be such a deep heart connection that comes naturally for women. When they step into this place of learning, openness, and clarity from within, anything becomes possible. Every evening we had the most amazing meals from the chefs in France. And every day we got to visit a new place. This was a monastery, Sanak, and it was just gorgeous, just gorgeous. You can imagine what life must have been like for the hundreds and hundreds of years. And Fontaine del Vaucluse, words can't express how amazing this place is. Water everywhere. It's the Venice of France crystal clear, beautiful green from the plants growing underneath the water. And that is the mother of the water, where we could hike up and see where it comes from. It had ancient ruins from the castle, medieval churches and buildings and architecture. It was pretty much a dream come true. And I hope you can join us next time. <laughs>